What's up, Aries? It's me, the Fly Empress, and I'm here to give you guys your mid-August to the end of August rating. How y'all doing, booze? <laughs> y'all, I apologize for the delay. I had did nine Zodiac readings, like, back to back, back to back. I was so exhausted and drained. I was like, I'm going to have to get to my fire signs the next day. But I'm here now, y'all. We're going to go ahead and jump into y'all reading and see what spirit is wanting for y'all to know mid-August to the end of August, okay? Spirit, show me what I need to see here for my Aries. Show me what I need to see for the Aries. Mid-August to the end of August. What do they need to know? Hermer. <laughs> Lighten up. Okay. Lighten up, Aries. Okay. Okay. There could be a need for you to forgive at this time. Or somebody is seeking forgiveness. But they might be denied. <laughs> We got the now here. Okay, we got judgments. Yeah. I feel like y'all done made a decision. Okay, especially if this is regarding somebody that was in your life. This could be somebody who want to come back into your life, but you're like, hell no, nah, fuck that. I don't want that shit no more. Um, <laughs> but I do feel like your energy is a lot lighter since you released this person or you let this person go. It says, I choose to focus on the lighter sides of life. Um... You could be in a very serious energy at this time or Aries, but some of you, you're needing to lighten up or do something different. Maybe you was in a situation where it could have got very heavy. And I am seeing like um, a release here. Something, some of you guys are releasing here or forgiving yourself about a situation or forgiving someone about a situation here. I'm hearing, I keep hearing the past, the past, the past. I acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love. Yeah, or this is something you're needing to do. It's time to lighten up your energy or remove some type of dead weight. Something here could have been holding you back. We got, I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the insight of awareness. There could be something that is bothering you at this time, but I feel like um, spirit is giving you some type of awareness or some type of enlightenment is about to come into your life. Okay. Yeah, I'm hearing clarity, the truth. Let's see. <clears throat> spirit, show me what I need to see here for the Aries. What's going on between now and the end of August for the Aries? What do they need to know? Show me what I need to see for the Aries. Mid-August to the end of August. Oh, good Lord. Okay, we got new home is on the horizon. Okay, for some of you guys, you could be relocated. For some of you guys, you're about to move to a different state or a city. For some of you, you're moving to a new position in your life. But I'm hearing a new home. Somebody could be getting a new apartment or a new place to stay. Um, I'm hearing better pay. Okay, this could be like maybe your rent too goddamn high right now. And you could be finding something better. You could be downsizing or you're going to find something that fits your budget. That's, that could be for somebody very specific. But I feel like this is a blessing. Okay. The person that I'm talking to, somebody could be very stressed. Okay, we got bald, losing hair. Somebody could be wearing their braids too tight or like is stressing out about a situation. But this could be somebody, if you're effeminate, you could be dealing with a masculine energy here that's wanting forgiveness from you. Or this person is real stressed out. They losing hair. They could be going bald. This could be somebody who wear a lot of hats. Yeah. Um, but I'm seeing a lot of stress. Somebody could be putting too much glue in their hair or they not doing their hair right. What the hell is going on? Somebody could end up going off on somebody who do hair because they noticing their hair is coming out. Or like maybe this is somebody who use chemicals. And maybe you told this person to just wash and blow dry your hair and flatten it out. They could have put some type of chemical in your hair and it could be causing your hair to come out. 
but I really feel like for a majority of you, if this is you, this is something dealing with stress. And spirit is trying to move you into something better. There could be something that you're needing to let go of. So something better can come into your life. Spirit. We got behaviors and patterns here. This is coming out in a reverse. Okay. Somebody have changed though. And I am seeing a man. Okay. For some of you guys, you could be a man. Or you could have been dealing with a masculine energy here. I feel like whoever this is, this person is wanting or seeking your forgiveness at this time. But you could be denying this person access into your life. I just heard I put in a lot of work. So this could be somebody who have changed their ways. Or, you know, maybe this person was a hoe in the past. They had real bad behaviors. This could have, this could have been somebody who had some type of addiction here. I just heard putting on a show. Okay, we got lights, camera, action in reverse. This could have been somebody who was putting on a show or this person played a lot of games. This could have been somebody who um, seek validation from a lot of people. But yeah, it's like they don't want this no more or they realize that this don't make them happy. <clears throat> For some of you guys, you could be taking a break from social media. Okay. Yeah, I'm here and protecting your energy right now. You could be protecting your energy from people that you done walked away from. I feel like you got a lot of people that want to come back to you, but you could be denied access. Okay. <clears throat> we also got survivor here against any odds. <clears throat> so some of you guys, you've been in survival mode. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. I've been doing a lot of readings tonight. Some of you guys, you've been in survival mode, okay? Um, you've been making ends meet or trying to get a lot of things done. But I feel like spirit is bringing in a new opportunity in your life. And whatever this opportunity is, you won't worry. Have to, you won't have to worry about doing this anymore, okay? Somebody could be penny pinching, penny pinching at this time. Okay, trying to pay bills or trying to get a lot of things done. But it's like spirit is tearing down an old foundation and rebuilding a new foundation. Uh, for some of you guys, you're about to see a major change. Okay, especially between now and I'm here in September. Okay, um, spirit, some of you need to see Aries. Yeah, okay, we got young and dumb. Karmic ex-partner has not changed. Don't trust them. Okay, yeah, this person realized that they was young and dumb, though. Or they was very immature. This could have been somebody who was up in age, but they act like a kid, a teenager, you know. They was just out here running around or playing a lot of games. I just heard, for somebody, it's a survivor, okay? Somebody could have survived um, emotional abuse, mental abuse, physical abuse, Okay, they was dealing with somebody who was very young and dumb. <clears throat> yeah, I'm hearing Rihanna. How about a round of applause, the standing ovation? You put on quite a show, really had me going. Somebody has definitely found out the truth about somebody that they was dealing with. And I feel like they're making a decision to walk away for good. But I feel like this person trying to come back. This could be somebody who's messaging you or texting you or you know, having a friends to reach out to you or something. <clears throat> Aries, I'm seeing y'all breaking generational curses here. Okay, for some of you guys, you could have watched your mother be in abusive relationships. Like this could have been emotional abuse or being with a cheater here. You're breaking some type of curse, okay? I'm hearing I'm not going back, okay? Because you know, like the same thing is going to happen again. For some of you, you're breaking some type of behavior or habits in your life, okay? Something about the show being over or you no longer putting up with shit that you, that you shouldn't have to put up with. Yeah. Yeah, because something could have had you, like, stressing out so bad that you was losing your hair, your nails weren't growing, like, yeah. Spirit Aries. <clears throat> 
someone is trying to block your access to your divine inheritance okay somebody definitely want to come back into your life family but i feel like this person bring destruction or darkness wherever they go this is somebody who's unhealed at this time this could this somebody who definitely played a lot of games this person could have played a lot of games with you and i just feel like you sick of their bs okay you sick of their bs okay we got protection not everybody that's interested in you have your best interest at heart so this could be a user okay or somebody who's only coming in to um take from you whether that's your time your money your energy or you know your home i don't know why I'm, I'm seeing a bomb okay for some of you guys you walked away from a bomb here you're breaking a generational curse <clears throat> we got text message okay family you could be blocking somebody text messages or blocking them i'm hearing blowing up your phone we got lone wolf choosing to be alone and isolating oneself. So yeah, you're isolating yourself from somebody here. For some of you guys, you're pulling, like I said, you're pulling back from social media here. Um, you could be tired of something that you've been doing for a long time and you could just feel like you need a break. You need to be by yourself at this time or this is how you feel when it comes to relationships, okay? But I am seeing major changes here taking place. <clears throat> Let's see. Spirit, show me what I need to see for Aries. What else do they need to know at this time? Aries. What do my Aries need to know? Yeah, you blocking something here. I just heard, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> Spirit, show me what I need to see for the Aries. Oh, oh, child, who you got in their emotions? Somebody in their emotions, in their head. I'm hearing stuck. Somebody is going down memory lane. Um, Aries, this could be you. We got Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah, but with the moon being here, it talks about things that's hidden. It could be talking about subconscious dreams. <clears throat> this is also talking about fears yeah for some of you guys you fear repeating the past here or you could be like in some type of nostalgia energy we also got cancer here we got the death card at the bottom of the deck but something is ending here yeah spirit we got the king of swords somebody is going to be reaching out to you Somebody want to talk. They want to clear things up. Yeah. Yeah, but this person is wounded. And I feel like for a lot of you guys, you know this. This could be a um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Yeah, tower. <laughs> I'm hearing just won't leave me alone. Somebody won't leave you to hell alone. Okay, family? And I feel like you're trying to stay away from this person. For some of you guys, you could be doing a lot of reflecting over a job or something. And you could be wanting to walk away, but you could fear this or something like that. You know some type of change is needing to take place. But for a majority of you, this is a lover. Okay, we got two people here with the tower. And we also got the lovers here. Spirit. We got the two of pentacles. Family, um, somebody is juggling here. Um, somebody is trying to come up with a plan. Trying to figure out what's the best option. I really feel like this could be somebody connected to you. But for some of you guys, you're juggling a lot right now. There's a tower that needs to take place in your life. It's like spirit is trying to rebuild your life on a solid foundation. Because something here... Is crumbling down and I feel like you could be trying to come up with some type of solution at this time okay yeah spirit why is the moon and king of wands here yeah five of cups like I said somebody in their emotions somebody doing a lot of reflecting here 
And if this is you, Aries, spirit is telling you it's time to lighten up or it's time to drop these burdens. Certain things will be coming up so you can address them, so you can finally heal and move on. Yeah. I don't know why I just heard it's a storm coming. Okay, it's a storm coming. I don't know, it could be storming where you at right now, Aries. Or this is some type of storm that you're going through in your life or something could happen very suddenly. Yeah, but I feel like you're going to get clues before it happens, okay? Only take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest behind. Yeah, but we got the seven of wands. Yeah, somebody definitely caused a lot of pain or trauma in your life. You blocking this shit. You don't want to hear nothing this person got to say. Not nothing at all. And I do feel like this is a lover, okay? Or somebody from the past. This could be a friendship or something. Or this was somebody who put you in a friend zone. With the Ten of Wands. Yeah, this is heavy. Family, I'm seeing something coming down in your life. Something that you might not be prepared for. Or you need to prepare for. Because this is coming out as a challenge. It could be some type of struggle you're going through, but I really feel like spirit is trying to rebuild your foundation here. So pay attention to any intuitive messages or downloads or anything you get from your dreams. Okay, especially if this is regarding um, finances here. Spirit, why is the <clears throat> two of pentacles here for the Aries? God, my throat. Yeah, you got options coming in, okay? New opportunities. Yeah, clarity. For some of you guys, you're about to find a new partner, okay? A new lover. This is giving me chemistry, romance. Um, but there is a new beginning when it comes to relationship for some of you, for those of you who are single. Um, but for others of you, I'm hearing like a callback. This could be a job or a new opportunity that's going to be coming in for you. Like maybe you've been having to deal with a lot, handle a lot, or take care of bills here. But um, something solid and stable is going to be coming into your life. Okay? And this is something you're doing on your own. Yeah, I'm hearing clarity and confirmation. So some type of confirmation is coming into you, Aries. All right. So, yeah, this could be regarding work. So, family, that's what I got. I hope y'all enjoyed this reading. If you did, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Ring that notification bell. And until we talk again, I love y'all so much. Peace.